just of uh, how much photography I'm doing. Hopefully it will turn out to be a nice sunrise and then I'll put it up online for you guys. Not sure how many shots I'm going to take so far, but uh, I did a moon last night with about 400 shots, about over 3 seconds each and it turned out pretty nice. We'll see how this one goes. So I use Magic Lantern software to do my uh, time lapse with the intervalometer, and uh, you can set it to different settings that you want. I have it on three seconds right now, but you can add or take away. And the Mag Magic Lantern is a uh, third-party software for Canon products, and it works really well. So once I have my uh, time set that I want, I just uh, hold down the shutter button, take a picture, and it'll take a picture every three seconds for as long as I want it to. All right, let's check our progress here. 351. So I'll let it go just a little longer and then we'll come back out and check our progress. But it's definitely progressing very nicely. And why do I care about sunrises? Comes up over there. And it's these babies. Very powerful house. It's always a good day when the sun rises and the, uh, the clouds aren't too plentiful. So right now I have uh, 603 watts coming in and I'm running a 24 volt system and I have 26.2 volts that uh, I can use right now with 23 amps. So uh, on a good day I'll get upwards of 800 watts at any given time because the way the panels are ran. Okay, I think we're probably pretty good. Oh, my battery died anyway. Stopped at 550 shots. That's too bad, because that is beautiful. So we'll see how it all turned out. So I brought my time-lapse uh, photos, the ones taken for the camera, and ported them into Premiere Pro. And it was real simple, you click on the first photograph and then do image sequence, and it'll bring them all in as one frame in one file. And then I'm just rendering it out right now.